Right, so perhaps I was a little bit too overzealous or matter-of-factly when I said the difference between memento and force multiplier is exactly 10%. If you have zero skill damage attributes, the difference is exactly 10%. However, you will gain slight edges here and there depending on how much skill damage you have. Spreadsheet I had up at the start with the absolutely beautiful music kind of showed that. With the exact build I am running now, just on skills alone, you will gain 12.14% if you used Force Multiplier on your skills. However, you lose over 50% damage from your weapon. If you were then to use or add in Capacitor in the mix, you would gain 14.44%. The difference on like, capacitor providing you over a duration on your skill build using force multiplier, the difference between not having capacitor stacked and capacitor at max stack is literally 2.3%. So much damage it will give you, okay? It's not as much as a lot of people think. It's a very good weapon. But a lot of people seem to think that capacitor is like the most OP thing going. It is a lot better than most weapons with in sync what, past a certain point. But in sync is better at getting you a initial hit of overall damage. But yeah, anyway, memento versus force multiplier. You will gain just at base 12.14% with the build I've shown. Using capacitor, you will gain 14.44%. If the build that I am running using Memento has just picked up a fresh trophy. Memento will do 1.6% more damage. It'll admittedly only last 10 seconds. Now if I have just picked up a fresh trophy with capacitor at max stacks, Memento will do 8.8, sorry, 8.08% more damage so yes i was a little bit overzealous that at base force multiplier will only give you 10 percent more it's roughly 10 percent more the highest you can get it basically adding skill damage literally everywhere and using like a maxed out skill damage build is 16.28 percent that you will gain over memento guess what that still will not be the fresh trophy because that only puts you to 99.98 of the damage that memento will do and if it's capacitor at max stacks with a fresh trophy yeah you you only come to like within 95 percent so typically speaking memento throughout the long haul will absolutely beat force multiplier and that loot to shoot guy who put an equation in chat, don't do your skill calculations that way. That'll put you an average of 20, 28% over what you're actually doing. The only thing you need to take note is that the skill tier damage, so when you look at your skill tier where it will be X percent, that is just a separate equation, as is, yes, total skill damage. But that doesn't detract from the point that you're only really getting an extra 10% from force multiplier. Right, now for the funny part. Now, if you're a regular on this channel, you probably have seen a few of the conversations between me and Dispatch on just exactly how Obliterate works. Dispatch was actually correct. But it turns out that Force Multiplier works the exact same way as Obliterate, minus the individual stacking of each stat. So after you've done all your equations to get your base value of, the well, your current base value of your skill damage all kinetic momentum does is rather than work from the exact base which on a turret is 26,545 it will take 30% of your now current value and then add that back on this technically makes it a multiplier yes but it's also technically not multiplying with anything like glass cannon detox damage to armor opportunistic a few other stats they will directly multiply for example if you've got 10 percent damage to targets out of cover and 10 30 percent perfect glass cannon they do not give you collectively a 40 percent buff 
quite simply because it is not 1.3 plus 1.1. It is 1.3 times 1.1. What you actually end up with is 43% on the way it's like not a huge difference, but the more multipliers you have, this can grow exponentially. Not the same thing happens with kinetic momentum or force multiplier. They quite literally take your end of equation damage and just add 30% on it. For those people that are going, oh, but it's multiplicative, have you got glass cannon in your build? Because that's multiplicative and that will multiply force multiplier. It's directly not multiplying. Okay, this is like a syntax error that apparently I'm in the minority of because for me if it doesn't directly multiply it's not a multiplier so one of my I believe is in my clan but if not he's a good friend on discord I just call him Leo because I have no idea how to pronounce that but he has coined the term hard multiplier and soft multiplier which I really like and I for me at least I feel it really helps me out so a hard multiplier are things like damage to targets out of cover damage to armor put glass cannon opportunistic things that we all know that are direct multipliers strikers and then we have soft multipliers which are obliterate vigilance these are still technically multipliers but if you put obliterate and vigilance together they add so what this is one well 0 0.5 multiplier okay they've not actually multiplied together so it's a soft multiplier whereas if you put glass cannon and vigilance together, just normal glass can, so 1.25 times 1.25, you can check it yourself, I believe it comes out to about 1.56, it's not directly 50%, which is why glass cannon and vigilance will always do more damage than obliterate in vigilance. Same thing happens here, okay? Essentially, force multiplier is obliterate. It's technically a multiplier, but it doesn't actually multiply anything. As well as, this this is the part that's actually quite funny for me, because they outright state that I am wrong. But what they haven't taken into account is, as I said in that video, the duration and health actually makes a huge difference because of how skill efficiency works. So I went ahead and did the same calculations and added duration into it. See, one thing after talking to Dispatch has taught me one thing. Always look at the bigger picture, okay? I'm not just looking at what force multiply gives at face value. I'm looking at everything. The duration, the health, the overall damage, the overall effect, how much damage it will produce over a certain duration. Yeah, um, at best, force multiply is like 7% lower than Memento. At worst, it's over 25% lower, which means Memento technically is anywhere between 10% and 25% better than Force Multiplier. Um, yeah, you can feel free, um, Mr. Squad84 and Shoot to Loot to, I don't know, do whatever it is you do. But the fact of the matter is I'm not wrong slightly misguided in the fact that i've well as i said matter of factly said it is exactly 10 percent difference it's not it's roughly 10 percent difference it's anywhere between 10 percent and 16.4 percent which the moment you start adding duration in to memento means nothing because you're not going to make up for a total of 25 percent no matter how you want to work it so i'm not wrong you are and yeah next time you want to leave a comment have a look at the bigger picture please because like this sort of stuff actually really does wind me up and i will just continue to make videos naming people with clown music okay i don't do these videos in like 10 minutes this one i did because i already had the data already there i spend a week two weeks going through the math talking to other people play testing okay I, I don't just word vomit clickbait here we go I sit there I look at everything okay I do get things wrong I am not infallible I got obliterate completely wrong it took ages for dispatch to convince me and even then 
and someone else came in and went no actually you're being a bit of a dickhead you are wrong dispatch got like a 20 minute apology video basically on this one i am not wrong i am sorry to tell you it may be technically a multiplier but it's not directly multiplying anything you can tell this because of the wording it says increase okay there are some errors within the division code if you look at spotter versus perfect spotter spotter says amplify this is straight up multiplicative perfect spotter says increase despite the fact that perfect spotter is still straight up multiplicative a good way to go okay if you look at i don't know glass cannon obliterate again glass cannon says amplify obliterate says increase guess what increase means anyway hope you enjoyed this video and the clown music i think the clown music was amazing a very nice touch Mwah. anyway have fun good luck don't die it's bad for the health